Hi, Gina here with Peace, Love, and Homeschool, and today I'm bringing you our first night and first light of Hanukkah. As followers of Yeshua, we thoroughly enjoy the Hebrew roots of our faith. One way we do that is by celebrating the biblical holidays. Hanukkah is not a major biblical holiday, but it is one we love to celebrate. It's the one we've celebrated the most over the last 10 years. Even though we've celebrated Hanukkah for as long as we have, it's all been from book knowledge. We've never celebrated it with anyone who may have grown up with Hanukkah and all the knowledge that brings. We'd love it if we could find someone in real life, Jewish or Messianic, to come alongside and guide us. Here I'm lighting our family Hanukkah. A Hanukkah is a menorah that is used during Hanukkah. Instead of six candles, it holds eight. One candle for each night the oil burned in the temple when there was only one day's worth of oil available. We'll talk more about that in our next Hanukkah video. The little wooden bird is just a toy we had, but it's a reminder of one of our favorite Hanukkah stories called Tree of the Dancing Goats. We couldn't find a wooden goat, so we used the bird as a reminder. The dreidel was made by dreidel maker off of Etsy. I bought it as a Hanukkah gift for my son one year. The glass candle holders you see, that are grouped in fours, plus the one separating them in the middle, is our first makeshift Hanukkah that we used before we bought the Star of David. decorations you see we have bought or made over the years. We painted the faux mercury glass candle holders in vase. I forgot to get a flower for it, obviously. We spray painted the rocks. Did you see all the gelt or chocolate coins in which to play dreidel with? The little blue Hanukkah belongs to my son. I made it for him when he was little. bought a banner with all those little stars of David one year. Finally, I'll leave you with the time lapse of the remainder of the candles burning. It's so peaceful to sit and watch the kindled lights burning, meditating on the great miracle that happened in the temple and the light of the world, Yeshua, who has come for us to follow so we shall not walk in darkness but have the light of life. Shalom to you, my friends. Yeah.